So hey everyone this is Ad Chris come back with another new video now in this video i am going to show you how we can root your any google pixel phone here so i have a google pixel 7 and you can notice here i have already root my google pixel 7 here and if you want to root your any google pixel phone then how we can unlock bootloader and root your phone having three disadvantage of rooting here first disadvantage warranty will completely avoid here and second dis disadvantage is banking application not properly uh, working on your device after rooting you need to flash any module to fix uh, banking application here and third is your device will entire will uh, formatted here so first take a proper backup after that you can root here so first i want to check here uh, my device is currently not rooted yet by the help of root checker application you can uh, check here root uh, root status here your device uh, rooted or not here so you can notice a pixel 7 and android version 16 here if your device running on android or uh, I mean 8 to I mean uh, 16 or 17 then you can easily root by the help of this method you have to download some file and uh, room file here so first of all you can notice here uh, Android version 16 after that you can uh, after that you have to enable here developer option by tapping 7 time on build number you can easily enable here developer option after that tap on uh, system tap on developer option and you have to enable one toggle here so its name is OEM unlocking so you have to enable this toggle here and also you can uh, read read here this type of warning uh, warranty will completely avoid you like this type of after that uh, enter your passcode and you can easily enable here OEM unlocking here after that you have to download one application its name is magix manager i will also provide a link on my telegram you can easily download from there but if you want to manually download then you can uh, download from this website it's official uh, website of magix manager so you have to download here uh, magix apk in your uh, phone here okay you can uh, wait here after that download this magix manager and after that install this application in your phone here and if you have not subscribed this channel then subscribe it and like this video for this type of more content here after that you can notice your uh, super user section and module section is locked it means our device is completely uh, bootloader is locked i mean ro not rooted yet so after that you have to move on your windows pc mac or linux here so i having windows 10 so here you have to download some file here I'm going to show you how we can download all this file and how we can root your phone, how we can unlock bootloader here. First, you have to search here Pixel Stock Room here. Like if you're having Pixel 7, 8, 9, you can search here Pixel uh, X Stock Room like this. After that, this type of interface appear here. I mean, this type of uh, website appear here. So, type on this website here Google Developers. Okay, after that, this type of interface appear here. So, you have to scroll down here and you can notice here term and condition tap on acknowledge okay i have read and agree with term and condition tap on this option here and scroll down again here and you have to find your device name here so you can see uh, notice here lots of device name appear here like pixel 9 pixel 8 pixel 7 pixel 6 pixel 4 which device you having so according to your device you have to download here room file here so I'll show you how we can download for your device a room file here. Okay, so I having this Pixel 7. So first I am going to find here a Pixel 7 stock room here. So you can notice here Pixel 7 Pro after that a Pixel 7 here. So after selecting your device, uh, you have to download room file according to your Android version. You can notice here version 13.0, it means it's uh, Android version 13. So I have already flashed your Android version 16. If you flashed Android 15 and if your device is running on Android version 15, 16. So according to your uh, Android version, you have to download this room file. So my device is currently running on Android version 16. So I am going to select your Android version 16 and tap on link here. After type on link, uh, ROM file will uh, start downloading here. So I already have downloaded this ROM file here in my Windows PC. After that, uh, cut this website here, I mean browser here. Before you have to download here one more to, uh, file here, its name is platform tool. So you have to search in any browser here, platform tool for Windows, for Linux and for Mac, which uh, operating system you using in your PC here. So after that, you can notice here this type of Android developer SDK platform tool so type on this website i will provide link on my telegram you can easily download from there if you want to download uh, from there you can notice your download sdk uh, tool for windows for mac and for linux Ac download according to your uh, pc software here i mean operating system here so i having windows so i am going to download for windows here 
so i have already downloaded this both file in windows pc so after that cut this browser here and open your file explorer or file manager here in your windows pc after that you have to uh, extract this uh, room file here first okay extract this room file in same folder here after extracting open this room uh, room folder here like this type of room folder will create here code name is different here after that inside you can notice uh, this type of image zip here so also extract this zip uh, i mean zip file here in same folder extract this zip file in same folder it will take a few minutes few seconds according to your uh, pc speed here so extract this bo both file in same folder here like first extract you a room file after that uh, extract your uh, image zip file here after that this type of uh, folder will created in room file here like images so you have to uh, extract out extract out one image file its name is init boot so you have to copy this uh, image file in different folder first copy this uh, image file in different folder here so you can notice here i have copied this file in here download folder after that you have to move this init uh, boot file in your android phone by the help of data cable you can easily transfer here so i'm going to transfer this init boot image in my uh, google pixel phone here i recommend to copy this uh, image file in google pixel 7 and also keep to one file in your windows pc here so i'm going to copy this file here okay wait here So you can notice here I have already copied this init boot image in my uh, pixel phone after that open here magics application then tap on install here and select here uh, select and patch file after that you have to select here init boot image file which we have copied from my windows pc so you have to select this file init boot dot image after that tap on let's go this type of uh, installation uh, appear here and after that you can notice here all done then open here file manager or file explorer here in your phone and uh, tap on downloads you can notice here a uh, magic patch image here okay so you have to copy this file uh, i mean move this file in windows pc here so i am going to move this file in my windows pc here okay after patching we have to uh, move this uh, file in windows pc so i am going to move or copy in any folder here after moving this file you can notice here i have already moved this magic patch file on my windows pc here after that we have to open here file explorer again here and extract this uh, platform tool in your windows pc you can notice here this type of folder will created here so go back and copy this platform tool or cut and tap on this pc local disk c drive and paste here you can notice here local disk c drive and paste this platform tool here after that make sure you have to take a proper backup of your and i mean pixel phone up because after the unlocking of bootloader your device will entirely be formatted here so please take a proper backup of your device after that power of your phone then you have to connect your device with your windows pc or mac here then you have to press and hold your power plus volume down button for a uh, boot in fast boot mode so you have to simply uh, keep the hold power plus volume down button for 10 to 15 second maximum to maximum here okay so wait here okay after that you can notice here this type of fast boot fast boot mode appear here and also you can notice a device status is locked but here also you can notice here unlockable here okay so after that we need to check uh, if our fast food driver is updated or not on my windows pc for this tap on settings and after that uh, tap on windows update check for update any driver available for update like a uh, lee android fast boot driver or any other driver so first update your driver here if you using a uh, windows 10 then you can uh, update from there if you using windows 11 then you have to tap on advance and then you can uh, update your drivers Okay, you can notice here this type of driver available here. Leave mobile other hardware and to add bootloader inter interface like this type of uh, driver uh, will show here. So you have to download or update your driver here first. After that, open your platform tool here in your Windows PC and tap on here. 
first clear all these things here and after that you have to tap, uh, enter here cmd and tap on enter first we have to uh, run command for bootloader unlocking here it's a fast boot space flashing space unlock so you have to enter here fast boot space uh, flashing space unlock after that you have to enter here okay after that this type of uh, option appear here in your phone here you can notice here uh, do not unlock the bootloader so simply you have to press your volume down button for unlocking bootloader here you can notice here so tap on volume down and after that type power button for unlock the bootloader here after that your device will automatically restart in fast boot mode and also you can notice your current uh, status is unlocked it means our uh, fixed device has successfully unlocked here after that we have to flash this uh, magic patch boot image here so for this uh, you have to put here fast boot space flash space init underscore after that uh, boot here and after that uh, take a one space and after that drag and drop this magic patch file here so i am going to drag and drop here drag and drop this magic file after that hit enter here then you can notice a sending writing and finish it means our uh, magic uh, boot image successfully flashed on our device here after that we have to put another command it's a fast boot space reboot and after that take a space here then your device will automatic uh, boot in system here it will take here uh, one or two minutes for first time here so we have to wait for booting your device and after that we have to take a quick setup of your device because your device will uh, entire will formatted here you can notice here you can connect with your wi-fi and if you having any sim then you can use your mobile data here for set up your device you can easily set up this uh, your device here it will ask for your old passport uh, i mean passcode here so you can enter and set up your device after that you can notice uh, this type of magic application so here then you have to tap on it and tap on ok make sure your device connected with internet after that this type of interface appear where required additional setup then you have to tap on ok your device will automatically restart for one more time here so you have to wait for restarting your re restarting your device after that this type of magic application appear here you, so open this application and you can notice your uh, module section and super user section unlocked here it means our device has successfully rooted here so for checking this i have downloaded this root checker application in my pixel device here so install this application if you want to check your device rooted or not here so install this application in your uh, device from play store or any app store here after that tap on verify then grant the permission then you can notice your congratulations root access is properly installed on your device it means our device has successfully rooted here so if you want to root your any pixel device then you can uh, easily root by the help of this method that's all about today's video thanks for watching this video if you haven't like and subscribe then you can do we will meet soon in another video here